And if he started coming down the tree, what would we need to do? What would we need to do if he came down the tree? <gasps> We'd need to run away, go back in the house. Right? Well, 104 East Audrey Drive. We've got a, uh, looks like a black bear. He's got a little bit brown on his nose there. He's a, I grew up here. We've never had a bear in our yeah. area. And he had to come quite a ways to get up there. He's pretty high up there. And uh, I don't see him coming down anytime soon. But I'm hoping uh, nobody messes with him. And he goes on his way because we got kids. You know how that is. Well, what do you, what are you hoping is going to happen here to... Uh... Are you worried for your kid's safety? Yeah. For yeah, my youngest has autism. Like I said, he would be up there in the tree trying to play with them. He has no fear. So, I mean, if he was to come down and my kids were in the backyard playing, he could, they could hurt. He could get hurt. So, so, so where are your kids, what were they normally, would they normally be outside playing if the bear wasn't outside? Oh, we'd be playing in the backyard. Yeah. we play in the backyard. But get the energy out. Right. It's a wild animal, it's a bear.